And the reason why like I classify this as like the dark side of Twitter is because a regular user would never know stuff like this is going on. some traveling for the weekend. It's been a very hectic week lately. Nothing to play around about. How you doing, sir? Irrelevant. No good morning, no nothing. Yeah, it's very early. Extremely early. Yeah. I got blood on my knees. Knee deep in mud from the mud, let me breathe. He just should throw let him die in the screech. Cigarette buzz glass and rocks on my teeth. I'm choking out, I need oxygen, please. Red in the day like I lied to my phone. Alright, so I wanna tell you guys about Telegram decks, right? Or Twitter decks, group chats, really. It's group chats where Instagram or Twitter profiles, but specifically Twitter profiles, interact with each other through retweets and likes. So there are two types of decks for uh, Twitter. There's a promo and then there's prosper. Promo decks are for SoundCloud links, YouTube videos, and stuff like that, while prosper decks are for tweets that, you know, are relatable. I was in three prosper decks, right? So three different chats with profiles that had like 50,000 followers, 14,000 followers. What we do is send in our tweets and everybody in the deck will retweet that tweet that you sent. So you can imagine if you have 20 profiles that have over 20,000 followers retweeting everything that you tweet. So technically these decks can control people's timelines. You see my tweets, but you don't follow me. And it's like you would see my tweets every single day, but you have no clue who I am. And then you end up going to my profile and following me. So very smart way to network and build communities. Eventually Twitter caught on and Twitter didn't like it because of the promo decks. The promo decks basically or selling retweets basically. So if you paid somebody $20 or something like that every week, they would retweet all your stuff. You would get hundreds of retweets and stuff like that. And people just made money off the whole process when some of us were just in it for growing our pages. Like we're just trying to grow as content creators while some people were like making an actual living off of it. So um, Twitter didn't like that. And everybody that was ever affiliated with the deck was shut down. So big pages like at Dory and at Girl Post, those, t those big pages that a lot of people paid attention to, they got shut down um, because uh, either they used to be in a deck or um, they used to steal tweets, as in like they used to see smaller profiles tweet something and then like completely take the tweet and post it themselves without any credit or something like that and get a bunch of attention. Yeah, there's a lot of shady stuff that goes on on Twitter. And then, you know, some people just use their profiles to retweet stuff. And some people, they post random stuff about their friends and they're, like, really engaged with their friends and stuff like that. And then some people are actually, like, using it as a business. And um, at one point, I was getting 2.1 million impressions, tweet impressions, per month. So every month, my tweets came across 2.1 million people's cell phones and that is absolutely insane so um and the reason why like i classify this as like the dark side of twitter is because a regular user would never know stuff like this is going on that it's coming from all one group i'm not affiliated with any decks because you can you know really lose your profile every time you join one so um yeah twitter no longer allows for that type of growth. One of the requirements to stay in these decks, uh, mass. Massing is following large, large numbers of people and it would go up to like 700 a week. So if we followed 700 a week, then we would gain, if our tweets and stuff were, you know, good, like two to 300, maybe 400 new followers every single week. So pages, all of our pages were growing immensely, constantly, every single week. And um, I would update my profile picture, banner, description, all those things 
constantly so it was an ever evolving page so the next couple videos are going to be about uh, gaining followers, organizing your page, writing a good description, and then your profile and banner picture. Because Twitter is a place where if you post something really good, you can get a lot of retweets really fast and you can gain a whole lot of followers really quickly, unlike YouTube and Instagram and stuff like that, where you literally have to like generically ask for people to follow you, you know, go interact with other people and stuff like that. So it's really easy for new Twitter followers to come landing on your page. That's all I have to tell you guys about the dark side of Twitter topic that doesn't really get talked about that much. Guys, I updated my website, R-O-L-E, tape dot com is officially up and running i have new products on there i have uh places where you can get booking information and stuff like that um as well as uh, my partners people that i work with artists that i work with as well as models and um there are internship opportunities on there as well as brand ambassador opportunities on there so i'm really building this network and community uh, for you guys. If you guys want to be a part of that, go ahead and check out my website. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And uh, um, if you like this type of content, go ahead and smash that subscribe button and tap the notification bell to get notifications every time I drop a video. This has been, I feel like I sat here and talked for like 10 minutes. I'm going to try to condense this down to like five. I like having five minute videos because I feel like they're good you know, attention span number. I feel like somebody will sit there for five minutes and watch a video, but you gotta really love me. You gotta really tune in to watch a 10 minute video. So keep this as short as possible and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Me deep in mud from the mud, let me breathe. He just should throw let him die in the screech. Cigarette, buzz glass and rocks on my teeth. I'm choking out, I need acid.